Congressman Salazar, let's Correct. talk about something else, and that is this is an important time because curriculum is being formulated for next year, at which time Governor Ron DeSantis has been out of his way to say CRT, critical race theory, will not be taught. But he didn't stop there. Listen. We have uh, a number of people in, in Florida, particularly southern Florida, who've escaped uh, totalitarian regimes, who've escaped communist dictatorships um, to be able to come to America. Uh, we want all students to understand the difference. Why would somebody flee uh, across shark-infested waters, say, leaving from Cuba to come to southern Florida? So he, uh, he understands that maybe this story, teaching the evils of communism and Marxism, matters to people like you. Why? Absolutely. And you know, bravo. Every single governor in this country should follow suit what the census is doing. Because the problem that we have here is that half of our teenagers, according to the latest uh, survey, believe that communism or socialism is good. And most of them don't know what's the difference between the Declaration of Independence and the Communist Manifesto. You see, I am the daughter of political refugees. Everyone that I that I know that surrounds me in my district understands what DeSantis is saying. It's oppression, it's exile, it's, it's death. And our kids, right. that the American-born kids, don't know what that means. So it's time for us to teach them that Che Guevara, Fidel Castro, Chavez, those people are murderers.